investigate a tip that I heard about over on the internet. A couple of my friends were telling me about a place called Den in Denel, New Jersey, called Eight on the Break. I have the directions printed up here. And uh, what I've heard, they have some unique stuff. Um, they have a row of pinball machines, and supposedly they have a working medieval madness. And that's something that you don't really find much often, just because of all the moving parts. So I'm really anxious to check that out. I've also heard they have a couple of good racing games and other good fighting games. So we'll let you know what we find out. So let's see. Point blank, can't wait to try that out. And over here, of course, what Eight on the Break is known for, pool. So they have three pool tables here, and there's also one in the back. So we're gonna go check out some more. Let's come over. Okay, we're here at the lunch counter. Special for 24 years is the break steak sandwich combo. You get a delicious RC cola on tap, a nice big break steak, and a nice big plate of fries. All for four bucks. I don't know any place where you can get a good deal like that. So I'm gonna dig it. Very nice 
nice machine, and this even vibrates over here, if you can see that. Now let's see the final roll that we have to see. Alright, we got a very rare treat here in the back by the pinball roll. So if some of the two, two classic arcade games, we have Miss Pac-Man and Mr. Do. Now if we come over here, we'll see they have brand new Spider-Man pinball machine. Here's this the shadow with Mr. Alec Baldwin on it. Alright, nice. We have Family Guy. It takes money to turn me on. Oh! Or Monster Bash. First time uh, we've seen it here, Pirates of the Caribbean. It doesn't, doesn't do anything. This is brand new, Stern's newest one. One of the heads fell off on them. Pirates of Wheel of Fortune. Over here, very rare, rare indeed, a Working medieval madness. Medieval madness to find in good working order is insanely rare. The machine is just very notorious for breaking. You have the castle on the left field. You have the trolls that pop out. And then the other problem is, of course, the flippers aren't strong enough. There'll be the one ramp that I call the princess ramp, where you'll do it for the fourth shot. You have to go up into the table to uh, save the princess, and most of the time, it never works. So. If you find a Medieval Madness pinball machine and it is, is in good condition, give it a play because it is very rare and the game still sells for about like $3,000 in good condition and definitely worth playing. One of the other ones I've only played this once, this is Terminator 3 Rise of the Machine. You have been targeted for termination. Yes. It's very nice because we have Arnold over here to play with. So we're, no, we're gonna go and play some more and we'll have some more uh, of our investigation here. So let's get our dollars out and load up. Madness there wasn't fully working. The uh, left troll on the side, you know, it's still great to play it in condition like that. Um, we all got hooked on uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, and Spider Man's always fun to play. And, you know, I'm looking forward to just going back there and seeing more of what they got, and hopefully they'll get the new Indiana Jones pinball machine this summer. So, considered a good arcade? Is I would an arcade? consider it a very good arcade, and I think we, uh, 
you know, we got to go on to the next one, do the next one, right? Yep, yep. on to All the right, next one. On to the next one. Peace, pal.